Hello everybody, this is Pinstripe Program. Welcome back to Let's Play Jan Dark. Last time we were here and Roger found us again, and this episode we're heading to the Chateau Burgundy. Ron Burgundy? That'd be a sight to see. Oh, I remember this. Oh, I remember this one because it's annoying sometimes. Yeah, it is rather quiet. Oh, uh, sup, dude? Where are your pupils? Okay, I, I, I kind of see them. You look like a ghost. What the frick? Uh, is this safe? Do I see dead people? Is this like Ghost Whisper or something? I mean, he doesn't look. Oh, okay. Uh, what the? Oh boy. Um, uh, well, maybe, um, hey, uh, guys, can you come in here? Oh, oh, well, isn't this just magical? He's what? Oh, oh, no. Another Reaper. No. Oh boy. So we have to defeat Superbia. I guess that's his name, but Jan can't fall in battle. There's kind of a problem here. And I'll get into this. But basically, Jan's right here. Mm hmm. Seems legit. Now. Okay, good. She does have HP recovery. I'm actually debating on just merging two HP recoveries and giving her an HP recovery two. Um, other than that, I think I'm okay with that. Um, Qesis. Uh, I'm not really sure if I'm gonna use him this round. Definitely want Cole. He's he's proven to be one of my MVPs. Um, Jeel, do I have a piercing power? No. Okay. Um, da 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 da. I think Jeel's okay. Rufus, heck yeah. I don't really need his HP recovery though. So, I mean, I guess it's nice. It does save some time, I guess, for a healing and all that. Um, and then Rose, I'm not even sure if I'm going to be using. Richard. Uh, I think it might just end up being the same as the last battle. I really don't want to. I, I would like, I would love to use Rose, but it's just, is she that good? No, she's not the best character. I mean, I think the next closest character to her would be, I don't, I don't really know. And even then, she does have the attack plus 20, so I can't even increase her attack more than it already is. So... I think I'd be better off just keeping it how it is. Um, definitely want Kolei in here because, if I'm not mistaken, there is a certain gem that I want to get here. And I can only get it in this battle. It might not be this battle in particular that I'm thinking of, but I know that's coming up really shortly. Um... I just gotta keep Richard in here. As much as I would like to use Rose, I don't think it would be very smart. 1200 HP? Okay, th this isn't the battle I was thinking of with um, those certain items, but uh, apparently the items in this game aren't randomized at least I don't think they are because 
I'm looking at a guide, and it says that, like, there are these specific points of, like, what they are. So, I mean, I guess I was wrong in that aspect, but whatever. We all make mistakes. It's just, like... It's like, how am I supposed to know that, that they're not random when I barely go for them, you know what I'm saying? So, okay. I, I'm not sure who I want to get the kill. I'm basically just wombo comboing him right now. Um, what, I'm, what I think I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to have these guys split up. One going this way, or two going th that way, two going this way. I feel like that's going to be the best way to go about this. It may or may not be the case. But that's what I'm going to do. Um, Kalei, just just become even more of a badass. And you don't even need two hits. That's how good you are. Man, I'm so glad I read up on how good Kalei could be. Because he's really stepping up now. Granted, he is level 44, but I mean, I, I really can't complain. Okay, again, now... Jan, how how does he work? Okay, he can move there, and his attack limit is the red, so that's something good to see. But will I be safe? I don't know. Luckily, I do have a lot of pretty good healing items to use. Okay, he can attack. That's nice. I think I will be in his range next turn, no matter what. Um, so that part sucks. But, ooh, this actually, well, no, never mind. I thought this would be a good time to use a move like Compass, but it's really not. He's only um, got like one space. So, okay. We have to wait here? Yeah. And then the door will open up. And as it turns out, there are some enemies. Well, most notably the Flame Flyer, which isn't going to be that difficult to take care of, really. Um, just move Rufus forward. Richard. And then, can I get to that door? I really hope I can, but I highly doubt I will be able to. If you couldn't guess, we can't just go through the front door. No, it's not that easy. Uh, as for Jan, how strong is he? Ew. It's not, it's not good. Might as well just go this way. Luckily, I do have a droid, so he can't really get an advantage on how he attacks me, which is nice. Um, okay, he's using Thunderbolt 2. That's not that... Uh, that's not too good, but luckily the HP recovery will help, and I might end up using a healing item too. Still don't know yet. Ha! Huh! Oh, yeah, Kole, you're a boss. Hmm. It's like, do I go in and open the door? Let me see what Rufus can do. He'll determine that. Alright, let's go. Uh, da, 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 Rufus, where are you? Right here. I'd have to move Kole no matter what it looks like, so... Uh, I, I just don't want to risk it, though. Because... There could be like, eh, they're not gonna hit Kole, right? <laughs> they better not. <laughs> Let's open the door! And it is an ogre. That's very far away, so I have some time to prepare. Now, Rufus, what can you do? Ooh, I like, I like. Okay. <laughs> I'll use extra MP to guarantee a hit. That's that's always nice. 195, I'll take it because it's going to die next turn anyway. Okay, what are we up against now? I still don't know over here. Um, who do I want to go in? I think I'd rather have Jill move in after Richard because Jill can take a hit or two. I believe that there's a couple different enemies in here. Ooh, my God, there's two ogres. Of course. Um, well, for one, it goes in here, you won't get hit. I'm pretty sure... It probably would have been better to just have them all move one way. Yeah, it probably would have. 
uh, come to think of it, considering there's only one ogre in here. I'm, I'm sure there's probably only one enemy in here. Um, but, whatever. Can't change it now. I should still be fine. Just gotta keep Jan healed up with whatever this is. There's really no point in healing. I mean, attacking with Jan. Ooh, another Shatter Axe. Yeah, the, the items are random. Because... Uh... Wait a minute, I'm probably looking at the wrong... Yeah, I was looking at the wrong thing. Whoops. Um... Yeah, there, I don't think there's like a special gem in here, come to think of it. No, the, there is a trident in here somewhere, but I don't even think that's true because of what I just found. Because I, I would expect that's where it would be. But, I don't know. I feel like that's just what the guy who wrote the walkthrough found on his playthrough. I don't know. But... There's only, like, a couple instances where an item is definitely there, and that would just be, like, a gem. Um, but... Nice that I'm getting that HP recovery. But, one thing I just wanted to show is that I believe Superbia has an HP recovery of its own. Um, let's... Let's just confirm this. HP recovery and experience bonus too. I really want to get a lot of his skills. But if I can just get Kole over here, that would be really nice. I just got to keep Jan away from him. Luckily, he doesn't seem to have a good success rate in attacking Jan. So that's good to see. And two hits. 266. Talk about overpowered. Oh my god, that did over 300. And you still can't even counter him. What now, son? Okay. Rufus, move here. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. YOLO swag. And I just got a Snapchat from my friend yet again. Man. And it's probably something stupid. Okay. Let's do this. What do I want to do? Yeah, let's go for it. Get that burning aura going. I believe I have a thunderbolt too, don't I? Yeah, but there's one problem. Oh, wow. That's actually a ton of damage. Oh, just regular thunderbolt? Okay. It's still more than enough, right? I mean, 18 damage. That should be enough to flirt with, right? Oh, it's way more. <laughs> okay. And wood chop. It's whatever. If I can get an HP recovery from them, that, that's even better. But I don't think that'll be very possible. I'm just... Oh, it's not even from that friend. Okay. That's cool, I guess. It's probably something stupid, though. <laughs> They're all probably... I mean, I get the stupidest Snapchats. I don't know about you. But... I mean... I'll get one where my friend is in his basement and he'll use hashtags. I'm like, this isn't Twitter. Don't use hashtags on Snapchat. I can clearly see what you're doing. You are blasting metal in your basement. I don't care. <laughs> uh, I mean, he's a good buddy and all, but like, he just sends the stupidest Snapchats. It's like, it's almost as if people, like, change once they get on the social media. I don't mean, like, personal. Well, I mean, I guess I do mean personality-wise, because it's like they'll say stuff you wouldn't expect them to say at all on, like, Twitter or something. They'll be complaining about everything when you talk to them in real life and they're just... doesn't seem like they have a care in the world. I don't know. I guess that's the real world now. It's all social media and... Yeah, it's... Whatever. Ha! <laughs> what now, ogre? You're not Shrek. Get out of here. They did have HP recoveries, but I didn't get one. <sighs> of course. Uh, looks as though... I might end up having to transform somebody. 
Not sure. Hmm, what about from behind? That should do a lot more damage. It is a lot, but it's not enough for me to feel comfortable. But, a Burning Aura does appear. I think I will transform with Richard. Um, just because he has the uh, Burning Aura and he needs to heal. So, yeah. Hopefully a Day of Judgment will be enough. I'm really hoping it will be. Let's try it. 174? Just 174? Hmm. Huh. Whatever. At least there's no counter. 173. You let me down, bro, by one point. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter here, but still, it could have been better. Okay. Ooh, God. There's two flame flyers here. Yeah, it probably would have been better to just stick with one, <laughs> uh, one route, but whatever. More experience. I guess. Okay, Jan, are you protected right there? I honestly don't know. Alright. Another HP recovery. Whatever. If you attack Jeel, even he might even die if he attacks Richard, too. That's the sad thing. Uh-oh. Cyclone 2? Why? Is that really necessary? No, it's not. But whatever. Definitely will need to heal Jan with a um, healing fruit or seed or something. And Woodshop. You missed. Ha! Aww. He didn't die. Well, on the bright side, at least somebody has their... Uh, at least Richard has his um, gem going, so I can just, you know attack the ogre most likely and then wouldn't have to deal with anything uh oh yeah nice job okay now what hmm okay I know with Jan I'm going to need to heal there's no doubt about that but let's just worry about some of my other characters first Rufus you're gonna be just fine. Just fine. I mean, he only regained like four HP. So it's not like it's that big of a deal anyway. Just move forward. Unfortunately, Rufus's walk mobility is not seven. <laughs> That's why I really want him to get a mobility plus one. Um, I mean, it just makes such a big difference. He's moving by five every turn. And we got a golem. Oh well. The golem shouldn't be too terribly difficult. It, it, I'm sure its defenses probably suck. Um, let's attack the ogre because I'm guaranteed a hit. And I'm guaranteed an extra turn. And, and a wood chop. Again. Not the HP recovery, but I really can't complain. Okay. Let's see here. This looks pretty nice. 102. Ooh, even better. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's see. Day of Judgment is just... It's probably going to be my best attack. I'm probably going to end up doing it twice. And... That was just enough, too. That's the scary part. Okay. Good, good thing you're getting some experience. Unfortunately, I I have both my armlet users over here, so Kalei and Rufus really can't move more than once a turn, which kind of stinks. But whatever. I really could have been done with this battle a lot a lot sooner had I just sent everybody one way. It just seems like you should have people going both ways, but I didn't. Oh well, sue me. Um, Jan, move in this corner, and healing seed. This is why you buy healing seeds. I forget where, but you just do it. Yeah, I'm, I'm not really looking for too much with the golems, to be quite honest. Um, well, actually, it's just one golem, 
There's actually... I, I'm pretty sure there's like two more ogres in the next room for uh, Jeel and Richard, believe it or not. Um, so that's going to kind of be annoying. Ah, uh, okay. At least, at least you're attacking Jeel. I know that may sound weird, but I mean, I'd rather have him attack Jeel than Richard. Because I can just have Jeel, you know, basically reset next turn or whenever I need him to. Oh no, not Body Slam. That totally did nothing. Actually, that did hurt a little bit considering Kolei's lower HP than the rest of my characters, so. I don't know. HP recovery. Yeah, so nice to have. Okay, enough stupid songs that really aren't songs in the slightest. Ah, oh, I'm one short. But I do believe this will do a ton of damage. Right? Oh. Oh, it did. I did 150, right? Nice. And then two hits for the win. Oh, close enough. <laughs> One away. Oh. Okay. Cool. Let me get body slam. Not like I really need it. I feel like skills like that are mainly just used for money. So, I'm not too concerned. Won't this kill it? Probably not. Okay. Now I can have Richard just do it. And then he can move forward. Hallelujah. Oh god, that's not fun. Fireball! Wow. 137. I understand I have a burning orb. Like, that's still a ton of damage. From what I was expecting, anyway. Another flame. That's cool. I'm getting a ton of those. I could probably make a flame too if I really wanted to. I really want some cyclone skills though, because then I can make healing winds. I think. If so, that's great. Um, move over here. I'm gonna go ahead and use a healing herb. Do I really need to? Probably not, but I'd rather just keep Jan healed as much as possible. And again, I don't want to be attacking because of the HP recovery Superbia has. So, it's like, it'll restore 120 HP every turn for him. That's why it's not a good idea to just go straight at him. So. Huh? Okay. Ha! 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 What am I, what am I doing? really don't know. And Richard is without his armlet now for the rest of this battle. Which, it's whatever. Let's see. Rufus, just move forward because that's really all you can do. Um, I'm gonna have you move forward here though, just because you're gonna have to turn anyway. Turn down for what? I probably could have healed Cole to... I didn't think about that. Oh well. Okay. Jeel, get moving. <laughs> oh, I'm right in front of the door, of course. Um, in that case, Richard? Yeah. Just, uh. Oh, I don't like that. Just heal yourself. Don't really need to, but I don't want you to heal Jeel and then be at a disadvantage. Because I'm pretty sure we have two more ogres. Well, at least, yeah. There's a lot of items in this one. Wow. Um, let's see. Other than that, I just need to move Jan, don't I? Yeah. Please avoid all physical contact. If possible. Okay. Superbia. What are you going to do? Oh, another Thunderbolt or Cyclone? No, oh, Thunderbolt 2. I feel like Thunderbolt 2 would end up doing more. Yeah, it did. <laughs> I mean, Thunderbolt 2 is just honestly more powerful. Yes, Cyclone 2 is more powerful than a regular Cyclone, but it's not better than a Thunderbolt 2. It's not necessary. 
for Superbia to use, so it's whatever. Hopefully I didn't give it any ideas. Lol. Ha! So wait, if it had an HP recovery too, I think it would restore like near almost a quarter of its health every turn, which would just be terrible for me anyway. Oh, yeah, Cole, you kind of got to move. Man, Cole is already level 44. All, and he's almost to level 40, 45. I believe two hits will actually get him two times worth the experience. Because it's, you know, two hits. Maybe. I think so, because I believe a regular hit would have just gotten him only, like, five experience. And the kill would have been, like, six. I, if that's the case... Well, cool. I feel like that red thing... I forget, it's the flame flyer, isn't that it? I feel like that's just gonna flop next turn. Uh... Uh... Yeah. I'll move Richard here. Use either Ice Bullet 2 or Thunderbolt... Uh, Ice Bullet 2. Just because it, it'll do slightly more damage, most likely. Will it? 151. Alright. That's certainly really nice. And then 121. 159? Okay! Uh, what else? I think that's pretty much it, besides moving Jan, but I don't think that's really necessary. Probably isn't, but I'm going to anyway. Uh... Healing herb. Just gotta keep her healed up, because Jan's the only one that needs to survive, but at the same time, she's also very important. I guess if you run out of healing items, what you could do is start using your, um... Uh, what's it called? Their armlets, or whatever. Um, that's certainly an option, but... Um... I don't know, I don't think it's that great. Why did this? Why did that one do so much less? I don't know. And hmm, do I have Cole open that? Nah, I think he can wait another turn. I need Rufus to catch up. That's the main thing. And you're you're about to go down. I'm having Geo transform next turn. Unfortunately. I can't. I don't think.